Hey Bears, this is Cub Master Chad. We are going over the Fur, Feathers, and Fern adventure today. Uh, step one of the Fur, Feathers, and Fern adventure is to do a one mile hike somewhere in your area. So it could be at a local state park, it could be at a national park in the Atlanta area, it could be on a city park or a trail in your area, or it could even be in your neighborhood. But it needs to be a one mile hike and while you're on the hike you need to be on the lookout for different signs of animals plants um, birds and different insects and things like that so you want to look out for the signs a couple things while you're on the hike with your family or your group i like to carry a few things so i have a backpack and i usually bring with me a bottle of water Sometimes I'll bring like a rain jacket or maybe it's August right now, so it's pretty hot, but if it's cold in the fall or the winter, you may want to bring some sort of warm clothing. Even if it's hot outside when you leave, it might not be so hot when you get back. A few other things you guys may want to take. Always good to have a first aid kit with you just in case you get into trouble. Uh, some other things that I take, Maybe a notebook with a pen. One thing I'd encourage all of you to take is to take a garbage bag with you. Because as scouts, we like to leave an area cleaner than what we found it. So if you find any trash along the way, you can pick it up and put it in the garbage bag. One other thing, just to help you guys on your adventure, along with this video, we are also including a bingo game that is a scavenger hunt. Sometimes if you go to state parks or other city parks, they'll have a similar type of scavenger hunt you can do. I encourage you to ask the rangers or go to the website of wherever you're going. But we're gonna include one that looks for having you look out for a lot of different things in different animal signs or different animals, whether there's leaves or ponds or flowers or uh, holes uh, in a tree, that sort of stuff. And you cross these off. I wanna see how many of these you guys can get. All right, so I hope you guys are ready for your one mile hike, even if it's in your neighborhood or your school or somewhere else, be on the lookout for some animals. You're gonna find what? Oh yeah, B. I know. Okay, I'll mark it off mine too. Ooh, an acorn. All right. Cause I found one, you said it wasn't. And that well, was it was like green, so. It was yellow, yeah. green, same thing. What is it that you found? A tree. Um, a hole in a tree. All right, let me see. You know, sometimes animals and critters live in those holes. That is a tree with a hole. I wonder if there's anything in there. Spider. That spider, guys. Where? No, it went back there. No, that's all spider. It's back there now. I'll take your word for it. Mushroom. Let me see it. It's Point right it there. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, that almost says. Yep. Bird nest. Bird nest. Bird nest? Where? Bird nest. It was up between those little, like, the rock and, like, the tree almost. What did you find? What did you find? There's a pond. I found three ponds. I think there's another one over there. Oh. I found about four ponds. All sorts of ponds. You can see all sorts of ponds out there.